Well, ladies and gentlemen, that delightful end of that song means that we are indeed back. Uh, let's see. I think I promised some Volgar the Viking, so let's see if we can get that going here. Give me just a second to kind of get those settings up here. Uh, make sure that I've cleared everything else out of the way that we don't need. Yep. And bring that back up. Excellent. And also, by the way, watch your ears just in case the music is too loud. I'll fix it once we get into the game. Okay, doesn't look to be too bad. Let's go in here, sound. Oi. How's that look? Yeah, it looks about perfect. Excellent. All right. So this is Volgar the Viking. Oh, wait, I forgot. I totally have to put it on the game capture part. Ha, 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 ha. Hmm. And let's try it now. Yes, perfect. So this is Volgar the Viking, and it is so amazing, and I love it. Let me turn it up just a little bit because uh, I love the music in this game. Okay, so let me get my comfortable, awesome gaming position because this game requires all of your concentration, and uh, I just knocked the crap out of everything. Perfect, good job. All right, let's be the Vikings we were born to be. I uh, I do really really love this game, and I've actually played played it. Uh, you know, extensively is the word that I want to use, and so I'm going to. I've played it extensively. I've gotten some of the Valkyrie levels, which are the special bonus levels uh, that you can get to only by having beaten the stages without dying and getting certain uh, tokens along the way. So let's see if I can replicate some of those amazing runs live. Because that would be pretty great to have it uh, on record. Uh, this was a game made by the people over at Adult Swim Games and Crazy Viking Studios. Uh, it is an absolutely brutally difficult <laughs> brawler platformer. Very along the veins of like, oh shit, ghouls and ghosts and such. Um, I'm really glad I got that item now and didn't just wait to get it later. Uh, let me go ahead and get that. Why not? It's filled with a crap ton of secrets and collectibles and <laughs> ways to make this game look incredibly simple once you actually know what you're doing. But to get to that point, you're gonna die a lot. <laughs> there we go. And so now that we've gotten this sword, we are now fully powered up. I am the Ultra Mega Zord of Volgar the Viking, and yet it all goes away so quickly. Like, I think it's four total uh, power-ups to get to this point, but only three, maybe even two hits to lose it all. So you really have to be careful with the decisions that you make. Like, that little jump right there, if you were to try and double jump onto this platform, you would absolutely hit those deadly, deadly spikes every time. So, because you have that dedicated jump arc, once you're going, you're going. Oh, shit! I got too arrogant with my spear throws. That sucks. I don't think I'm going to be able to get it now. Um, hmm, well... We'll see if I can still get at least one Valkyrie life. Eh. I might still be able to work something out. Hey, yeah. Pink. Yes. Okay. And now I can get a couple hits in here. Go to the safe spot. Hit that hit. And on we roll. Sweet. There's a pattern that you end up finding along the way. And if you can kind of get into the rhythm of it. Oh, shit. Woo. This game becomes a lot easier. And you'll notice some uh, guide points along the way, like all of these little stat. Ugh, son of a bitch, I'm getting careless. All these little statuettes that have the slots in them for spear throws are probably really good little platforms to throw, or little places to throw them in. All right, I might be able to pull this off. What you're supposed to do is not have. Uh, not have that one be there. Come here. Can I? Mm. Nope. I want to break it. I want to break it. I want to break it. Damn it. 
I'm gonna break that spear. I can't break it. Son of a bitch. What you want to do is get these two spaced far enough apart that you can uh, do your little jumpy sword slash here and hit the thing, but actually not breach that top spear. So then you drop back down to the bottom when that top spear serves to protect you from whatever shots that plant puts out until you can hit it again. Hiya! Oh, I love that spear throw so much. Uh, and, and every time you see one of these red flag posts, it's probably a good idea to throw a spear. Uh, at the, to get a fully charged spear and throw it because you've got some of the goblin enemies coming up. You'll see that uh, later on at the top of the thing here. Okay, and... Uh, 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 okay, I got my flaming sword. Uh, I hope, I hope against hope that if I can get to the top without getting hit, I should be able to pick up a Valkyrie life. Oh my god. There's so much pressure when you're doing it live. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, here we go. Uh, we made it. Oh god, we made it. There's actually another one of those safe charms uh, underneath this next plant. So I'll actually get a free hit coming up here shortly if I can get past this red guy. Come here, red guy. Die, red guy. Perfect. Okay, and one, two, three. Right here. Yeah! Grab that hammer of Mjolnir, and it protects you from one hit. If you get hit at any point, it uh, takes the hit for you and deals damage to enemies on the screen. So those are kind of handy to pick up, regardless of whether you think you need them or not. Because just because you know the way through, Volgar, does not guarantee you're going to make it. All right, so we go up here, avoid all these little goblins, and try and hit. Oh god! Uh, uh, okay, good. Woo. Uh, uh, throw the spear. Yes. All right. Hit that. Please. Ah, it just gives me treasure. All right, I got two or maybe three more chests left in this area, so we shall see. Uh, uh, block the arrow. Crap. Hello, snake. Bye bye, snake. Ah! Oh, that arrow was close. It gave me a little bit of a haircut. All right, so we can jump up here. These areas with the uh, scrawling upon the wall lets you know to throw a spear into what you'll see is some of those little boxed areas with the horizontal mouths that show you where to throw the spear. And those you'll notice that uh, block the other two shots, the outer two shots, I should say. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Really? Oh yeah, that's right. It's five. I forgot. And that takes that, that takes care of that shot, which means I can plug him here and charge it up nice and full. Perfect. All right. Let's go gather our winnings. Is there no no more secrets? Okay, whatever. Um, proceeding forward. Yeah. Oh, damn it! Whoa, God, I'm glad I had that. Oh, son of a bitch, really? I was so close. It would have been this chest right here. This chest right here would have had the freaking... Oh, that sucks. That sucks so hard. Oh, my God. I am half tempted to quit and restart because I know I can get it. I absolutely 100% know I can get it. Mmm, that pisses me off so bad. Fuck it. God, you guys didn't see that. I know I can get it. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I will make this as fast as possible. Because I want to show you these Valkyrie stages. They're fantastic. And like, you think the regular game is hard? You have no idea. Hey yeah. <sighs> so we have to hack in slash your way through again. <laughs> I feel so bad. <gasps> okay. We just can't rush. I was I was getting a little bit too excited because I was actually doing well and and I'm not used to doing that in this game. It's a little uh 
a little misleading sometimes when you actually start to do good because you you get overly confident and then you fuck it all up. <laughs> yes, I just reset the entire world all at once. What can I say? It's a special ability that most Vikings have. All right, now we can make this double jump. I can't make it. There we go. Yeah, you have to be very careful with how you make that jump because you can hit your head on that little post and it'll ruin all of your momentum and you'll fall in that cat giant chasm and just be horribly murdered. There we go. All right. With my HR flamey sword, we shall continue post haste. Yeah. Don't worry, the actual like boss part of this is ridiculously easy. I just need to get there. In fact, I've actually beaten the boss before in one like generation of his 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 shield opening thing. You'll you'll see what I'm talking about when we actually get there. All right. Hit. <laughs> Fuck the bees. Fuck the bees. I hate those fucking bees. All right. I think we're we're past the part where I got hit the first time last time. Let me jump. Hit that. Block. Yeah, cuz I remember that taking a lot more hits. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye, Mr. Redman. I'm glad you decided to stop by. I'm in full-on concentration mode, folks. No, once you get good, it isn't necessarily punishing. It just takes a lot of your concentration. And so what you're left with is <clears throat> this game that becomes insanely unforgiving, I think is a better word for it. So even if you know what to do, just knowing what to do isn't enough. You have to be able to implement it perfectly every time. Like knowing to hit the double slash on that, that you're never gonna be able to swing the sword fast enough to hit that guy as you're flying through. Okay, now we're back in the second area. Still haven't gotten hit. Uh, really, all I need to do is get to that first chest up there because it contains the first warrior soul, which is the ticket to the extra level. So, as long as I don't fuck this up, we should be okay. <laughs> No pressure. Jump! Jump! Yeah! There it is, folks. We're going to the Valkyrie stages! Woo! Oh! Okay. Sorry. Alright. Now we just have to make it through the rest of the level, kill the boss that's four times our size, and make it look easy. Right? Oh, damn it. Oh, well. At least I get another one right over here. That actually doesn't count towards anything. Like, as far as getting hits taken away for the bonuses, but that totally does. Son of a bitch. The, the other hit thing was right fucking here. Oh, well. It's okay. I got the I got the bonus life. That's what I wanted to get. We're good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And now we've actually, we're gonna get the flamey sword back, and who knows, we might pick up a second one because we've already picked up a first one. I don't know. I think you can pick up a maximum of three. In this, in this first stage. I think is the most I've ever gotten out of one. Run. Come on, get up here. Get up here so I can kill you. Eh, eh, you prick. Eh, you prick! Okay, well, at least I had that other freaking health item, uh, Mjolnir. Damn. Okay, down we go. Kill the bee. Block the arrows. And look out for the snake. Whew. Eh. If you lose the metal shield, your the first shield you pick up is actually a wooden shield that goes away after three, maybe two hits. And so you actually can't sit there and wait out stuff like that. It becomes a lot more difficult to, to hold on. 
Also, something I really love, uh, Vikings are very heavy, notoriously so. And so if they fall great distances, they won't hurt themselves. They'll make the world shake. I <laughs> love that. This game has so many great little touches. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Four, five. Whew. And chargey, chargey, chargey. Really? Really, dick bag? God, what a dick bag. There we go. <laughs> I hate the bees. Not the bees. Yeah. I'm glad that I could uh, take care of those that way. All right, so if I time it so that I jump when it's right over my head, I should be able to make it up in time. Perfect. And yeah, takes care of the spider, and we can just walk our way straight to it. Perfect. It's kind of got that piranha plant effect that once you're right up on it, they won't fire anymore. Like, right in front of it. Uh, I don't, I guess it doesn't work if you're underneath it. Okay. Okay. Turn around and turn around. Drop. Sweet. Give me more gold. Pink. <laughs> Unfortunately, there are no more chests, so I guess we're only going to have the one life. But that's okay. One life to live is perfect for me. That is all that I need to get through those bonus stages. No, that is that is not even close to true. You need all the fucking lives you can get. Those things are brutal. Ah, fuck. I was going to try and charge up the spear. I couldn't do it fast enough. Okay, first boss time. Boss time, boss time, boss time. Oh, you hear him. He's huge. He's gigundous. You see the red banner. That means throw a spear. So you throw the spear into him once, and you can start to do damage to him as you even go up top and kill him before he got the second swing off. That's how you kill the first boss, ladies and gentlemen. Quick and effectively. First level beaten in eight minutes. Not too shabby. Not too shabby, I don't say. Uh, unfortunately, I should have gotten more of the Valkyrie lives, but I got two. So two helps. I guess you get one from killing the boss and then one uh, that you find. And then you find the second one as well. So once you have found the Valkyrie thing and this treasure of top here, um, those are actually what go to unlock the true ending to this game. Very much uh, Ghouls and Ghosts style. But it also opens up a second pathway that takes you through a harder series of stages. Let us proceed. Uh, instead of getting checkpoints along the way, you're actually given these Valkyries that have the number of lives that you have around them. You see she has two orbs uh, going around her. I wonder if I can... Yes. If we zoom out here... Damn it. Yeah, perfect. I, was, I always wondered if the uh, charged up ones had a longer range, and they do. Woohoo! He, he, oh, that was perfect. Oh, and we got an extra life. I love it. I did not realize you can get extra lives for these stages in these stages. That's really handy. Okay. I'm, I am having to be a lot more careful here because I don't know these near as well as I know that first level. Uh, obviously, like, you end up playing that first level so fucking much by the time you get halfway decent that you kind of end up knowing it like the back of your hand. This one, not so much. But I do know that there's another hammer right there. And I can go jump, and jump, jump, and drop. Yeah. And if you try and jump from here, you won't make it to that other platform because it's actually two squares away. So you have to jump from here. It's tricky. Jump, jump. Jump, jump. Sweet. All right, now we're on our boat. I'm on our boat. And I'm going to get the chest. Damn it, I didn't get the chest. Oh, well. I tried to get the chest. The chest was just out of my reach, as always. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, damn it. Okay, good. Um... <laughs> Never been happier to have that freaking hammer in my life. Yes. Came just close enough. 
come here. Damn it. Fucking fucking things. I hate these fucking things. All right, I think I'm supposed to get back down on here because yeah, there's a chest down here and I can get back. Yes, the helmet. I wish you could do the lightning bolt like as a move because it get it like ew, that was close. Um when you get the the metal shield it tells you that or it shows you that you can do the charge spear maneuver. And when it gives you the metal helmet, it shows you the lightning bolt, but you can't, you know, do the lightning bolt. Jesus. <laughs> okay. And we're going to try that again. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, okay. And now there are spikes. Why are there always spikes? Okay. Shit. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that was lucky. That was pure luck. Woo. All right. Uh, I should be able to, yeah, get that and kill that guy. Sweet. Yeah, no, I like the way this works because uh, kill him. And if with that being the level that it is, I should be able to just roll right in. This game has such great mechanics, and and they're they're very, what's the word I'm looking for? Constant. Uh, they're they're very con constant mechanics, and so you never feel jilted by the game. If you make a mistake, it's usually you that fucked up, <sighs> and not the game. God, just like that. Um, I know that there's a way to do this. I know that there's a way to do this. I just don't know what it is. And I just don't, well, I kind of do now. Let's give it a shot. Fuck. Hmm. I'm not going to like this. I'm not gonna like this. We're gonna. I don't think. Yeah, that's not gonna be high enough. Um, I wonder. Crap. So I need to get. I need to get a spear onto. That panel there. <sighs> okay. Uh, I want. Ah, oh, fuck. Nope. That didn't work. I'm really pushing my luck here when I should just move on. Like, I really should just move on. So I'm gonna do that. I know it's taking the safe route. Okay, screw it. We're just gonna move on. Yeah, because it gives me that back there. Oh, shit. I totally forgot about this part. You can't shoot it in the block right next to you. If you try and shoot the spear into a block that's right next to you, your Viking strength is such that it just shatters, unfortunately. So you have to be at least a square away in order for it to actually stick. Yeah, it's it's quite horrid that way. Um, let's see. What you gotta do here is take that first leap. I'm gonna show you in this direction. Take the first leap, and when you get to the right point, stop your momentum with that second jump and drop straight down. But there are other enemies down there I earned a third life, by the by, uh, that you have to hit along the way to give you other jumps. So this is going to be quite tricky. I think we're getting very close to the furthest that I've gotten so far. All right, here we go. Huh. Yeah. Shit, talky mushrooms. Oh, I made it. Oh my God, I made it. Woo. I don't think I've ever actually made it through that part before. Uh, I'm gonna go and take out. Nope, can't do it from here. Yeah! Okay. I'm sure there was some solution to it. Oh yeah, by the way, there are breathing mechanics and you will drown. Just just to screw you over even more. This game has very Sonic-like breathing mechanics. Shit. Shit, shitty, shit, shit, shit. Shitty, shit, shit, shit. Shitty, shit. I'm not gonna make it. I think if you get greedy for the chest there, 
you're going to drown every time. I think you have to go back down for it after you get breath. Okay, so let's try that again. Hup, hup, and down we go. That throws me that way, that throws me that way, because equal and opposite reactions. Excellent. And so, we block the pearl, throw the spear, don't get the gold. That's too tempting. All right. Perfect. And out and up. And there's my air. All right. And now we can... Oh, shit. Welp. Screwed that one up. All right, we got to go get more air again. <sighs> up and over. Perfect. Out and over. There's my air. Okay. Uh, so you actually do get a decent amount of air, it looks like. You just have to use use it wisely. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, this is totally, like, why you hate the water levels in Sonic. They are the worst. Uh, because not only do you have to readjust how you do... Oh, God. Uh, uh, how you do the actual jumping mechanics. And your gameplay style. But you're also having to not die and it's even more butt clenching than usual which this game is very butt clenchy okay cool so we made it out and now these things constantly spawn great um shit if you try and just jump on the one guy he'll probably shit really yeah if you just jump on him there we go okay fine i guess that was the way you're supposed to do it um what's down what is down? I guess is what I'm trying to find out. Perfect. And now we're gonna jump on the chain. Um, we're probably gonna have to hit that ball over there with a spear as we go. Like so. Yep. Oh shit, I need that air that's right over here. I need that rarefied air. No, no. I needed my, I needed my shield. And, and I needed air, and now I'm fucked. I'm totally fucked. Perfect. Okay, cool. It's fine. I've got one more life, one more try with this, and if I fail here, then we will go back to Fibbage. Uh, or Drawful, one of the two. Because, yeah, uh, this and the little mini-boss beyond it is pretty much the furthest I've ever gotten. So I feel pretty accomplished with what I've done so far. Hell, I, wasn't, I was not expecting to get this far, to be quite frank about it. Oh, God. And up. And out. And up. And up and up. Sweet. Yeah. I love just that slow motion downward hit. Like, I'm gonna get you. Clunk. Also, that little squishy noise of hitting the... Hitting the little... Aw, oh, damn it! Fucking I hate those fucking things! God, mermen are the worst, aren't they? Uh, no, Random, you do not need your own copy of Fibbage or Drawful to draw, uh, play with us. You just need... Um... Okay, I guess that was how... Ah! Mother loving piece of poopy. You just need to be able to connect to a browser of any kind, either on a mobile device or um, through a regular web browser will work just fine. And you'll go to jackbox.tv. But all of those instructions will be very plain once we get there. Uh, 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 sweet. All right. We made it. We freaking made Oh, my God. We made it, and I am not happy about where we made it to. Ah, I knew it was going to jump at me. Oh, I had one more. Okay, then. I guess she was holding one. Sweet. All right, one more time. One more time, and then we're done. Here. Here. I need all of your strength, ladies and gentlemen. I need you to believe in me with everything you got. Here. Bye, Alex. Thank you so much for dropping by, man. I really appreciate it. Uh, Alex is one of the people who ended up coming over to my house the first time we did the Drawful and Fibbage stream. Or, not stream. First time I ever played Drawful and Fibbage. 
and and you know was a part of that wild and crazy ride that led us to be uh, to playing on it on the stream today. So that was really awesome, and I appreciate you coming by, man. It's always good to see you. Oh shit, we disconnected somewhere. Uh, it's okay. Don't worry. It's trying to reconnect. Yeah, are we back? I think we may be back. Okay. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. It looks like we dropped the, the internet connection for just a second. But I think we are back. Yes! Your spirit bomb energy crashed the entire stream. I appreciate it. Alright. Fuck you. Now I've got my spear and magic helmet. No, you believe too much. That was the problem. It's okay. I was able to make it through because of you guys. Are you crashing the stream or no? I'm proud. Yeah. Okay, so we need to trigger that so that I can drop right on him. Excellent. Yeah. Now we're getting it. Thank you, guys. This is exactly what I needed. And then up. Over. Oh, God. These are just one jumps. Oh. Okay, so note to self. Those things fucking jump. Because they're pieces of shit. Yeah, got it. Fuck your couch. Fuck your couch. Oh, God. Ooh, that was close. Damn it. No. That's not at all what I wanted to happen. Two bad things in a row. Perfect. Throw the spears. Throw the spears. Throw the spears. Well, I lost all of my important materials. Uh, I don't have any equipment left to me, but I am a super badass Viking, so we're gonna press forward anyway. <laughs> Wooden shield. Damn it. Oh, God. I don't like where this is going. Um, I think I should go down the middle, but I'm not 100% on that. Sweet. Yeah. Man, really? Okay, does this remind anyone of uh, the legend, the level in the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles where you have to go through all of the pink seaweed and it's all fucking uh, electrified and whatnot? You end up losing three turtles in the process by the time you defuse all the bombs in that fucking level. Okay. Hey, yay, hey, another chest. I always love other chests. I need air. Yes. And choppy choppy and air. Perfect. Man. Okay. Metal shield means that I can at least block projectiles. I don't really need the helmet. Uh, the fire, fire sword would be really handy. Oh, God. But not 100% necessary. I need to adjust the jump arc for this fucking underwater mess. All right. There we are. Whoa. Hua, hua. Awesome. Oh my god, I think we're at the boss. I have not made it here before. Wow. Achievement unlocked. Volgar, you are so smooth. I think that's a little, uh. Oh, Jesus. Ah, uh, he got me. What the hell? What is this? What is this? Okay, um. And then he electrifies the water. Okay. Noted. Well, shit. That was a learning experience, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, no, the gold is basically for points purposes. It doesn't serve any function. Um, and, and and going for a high score and leaderboard nonsense. Uh, that's Volgar the Viking. I think, I think I'm done with this game for now. Uh, that was really awesome. I, that boss just kind of kicked my ass. You, that's what you have to do. You get to the next place that you haven't been before. You face the badass enemy that you don't know what to do with. You get your ass kicked. And then you're like, okay. Noted for next time. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I'm glad you guys got to see that. I, I I it's I don't really record when I play those that game anymore. So you know, what can I say? Uh, I'm glad I got to do that live for you guys. We'll go ahead and quit this. Um, do 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 do. do. Sorry, didn't mean to drop the controller there. Ah.
And with that, I think, do we have enough people in here? Yeah, sure do. So, shall we play another round of uh, Fibbage and or Drawful? Let me uh, social media it up very quickly. Ow. These things hurt my freaking ears, and I, I'm, I'm getting really uh, tired of them, but I don't have any other USB headphones that that I have right now access to. Maybe maybe at some point. I know my the next headphones that I buy will be uh, USB headphones. Okay. Unplugging the controller. Ow. Oh, I'm sorry, Fred. That sucks that you got to go to bed soon. Okay, uh, then we will do one round of Fibbage. We'll take another break, and uh, then we'll come back and play a little bit more of whatever it is the hell that we want to do. Um, but we'll get one more game in before Fred has to go. Yeah, Jackbox games. Um, let me make us a tweets. Get some more people in here, ladies and gentlemen. We're kind of reaching a lull in our, our night. We've only got how many viewers? We've got eight viewers in here right now. We need more. Get me more viewers. Get me more viewers. Tweet to all your friends. Anyone who's awake right now, say, hey, look, come play games with us right now. Because right now is the time for games. Yes, yes, I know. Eight is the perfect amount for this. But you want to be able to rotate people in and out, yes? Good job, Mike. You didn't even put the URL in. What's the matter with you? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are in our first game of Fibbage. Our room code here is XFUO. Enter that into jackbox.com, or excuse me, jackbox.tv with your name. And we will get this game started. Hmm. Uh, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, I hear something interesting outside. There's a, there's, it sounds like there's a couple of drunk people having an argument, and I kind of want to go see real quick. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I swear. Enter the room. Go ahead and enter the room while I'm gone. We are, we need three more people. I want to have a full freaking episode, or a full freaking cast of people here. So we need three more people. Hmm. 
Okay then. <clears throat> Excellent, full room. Let's do it. Looks like I came back just in time. Uh, yeah, no, that oh, yeah, looked like a really bad argument. There was a whole bunch of throwing and cursing and... I wouldn't want to be part of that. Anywho, Fibbage. Jesus. Well, eight players Ugh. is impressive. However, <coughs> you know what's more impressive? A billion. But I'm sorry, Dari. I'm sorry you couldn't get in here. Of course it did. No, it would fix itself right before we get started. Get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. All right, pick a category. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, here's your first question. All Grim Acres is a nine-hole miniature golf course oddly located in an Illinois blank. Hmm. Now use your device to type a lie that might fool the other players into believing it. If you get stuck for half the points, you can use the help button and get a suggestion. Do it Are now. you going to get a suggestion? Do you need the help? Hmm. I don't. I know exactly what my lie is going to be, and it's a good one. Ruh row. It may just be pausing for you for a second, random. It kind of takes a little bit, unless it just kicked you out completely and said you're disconnected. Uh, in which case, we could totally rest. Okay, cool. Hurry, Never mind then. Me, Excellent. Perfect. Okay, here are your choices. Find the truth and touch it on your device. Boom, ba doom, boom, boom. Boom, ba doom, boom. Boom, ba doom, boom, boom. Hmm. I would say I would say funeral home or brothel, but those just seem like too good of answers. No, not a junkyard. Damn it. Not a swamp. Good job, random. Nice lie. Way to rack up those points early. Not wow, Mike. Picking up the truth. Your ball out of the cup, though. Those holes are six feet deep. <laughs> and nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Boom. Time to pick a category. All right, Mike, pick us a good one. Pick us a winner. I see arousal in there. Mm. No, never mind. They didn't wait for you. Here's the question. After an allergic reaction to steroids used to treat asthma, a 28-year-old woman started growing blank on her head instead of hair. Type in your lies now. Hmm. Um. What would be a good lie? Damn it! I couldn't help but enter the truth. All right, where's the truth? Of course, of course it did. Of course it did. God, I hate this game sometimes. Pubes, pubes, pubes. No, that's what natural man beard hair is made out of. It's the worst. That's why I hate it. I'll never have facial hair. Boom, 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 boom. All right, let's see what everybody picked. Yeah, I did too, Azure Angel. And it would, I like, I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't enter anything near enough to the correct answer that it would let me do it. Like I tried finger space nails. Now when she Nothing. Wants to look nice, she oh well, whatever. It's fine. Eddie. And that means some of these didn't get. Pissed. I mean, yeah, Boyle's got a lot there. 
Growing boils. Ugh. No, thank you. Pineapples and pubes and teeth. Getting the likes. Select a category. All right. Pick us a good one. Netflix. Netflix. Okay, here's the question. In 2004, the CEO of Blockbuster mailed Reed Hastings, the CEO of Netflix, an odd package. He sent him a blank. Enter your lies now. <laughs> I could have panicked and just entered something random and nonsensical, but I'm, I'm way too much of a perfectionist to do that. I need to answer something that's going to be actually picked and that makes me fluster and flub what are you gonna do you can't be perfect well you can try well you know what I mean do, 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 do. okay here you go find the truth I've I've answered this question wrong like five times, and I I think I know what it is, but I could be totally wrong. Cause this question does come up a lot. Like if you have actually like seen somebody play through this before or something like that, you've probably seen this question. Let's see what everybody selected. Good job, Fred, not entering again. God. What's the matter with you? Nope! Give me points! That's my lie. <laughs> uh... You don't have to keep it family friendly, but I will say this. Please don't be offensive. We're all trying to have a good time here. Other than that, I don't give a shit. Yeah, I thought it was the kitchen sink. And the rest of the board goes unselected. Yeah, all the way up to the top. To the top with me. That's where I like to be. Although the Betamax player is pretty good. Now it's round two, where all point values are doubled. Let's do it. Do, do, all right, do, pick a category. Do. TMOs, what you got? What you got for us? Lung, Invincible, Swedish, Barcelona. Okay, Barcelona. Question. According to a University of Barcelona study, surprisingly, 5% of people have absolutely no emotional response when they well, blank. Well, how many disambiguations of this do you think there are? How many different ways of saying this event do you think we will see? Because I'm gonna guess six. There are eight of us, six. At least six are gonna go in the same direction. Same erection, same direction. What did I say? Oh, two left. No, I didn't quite make it. Are you, uh, one got in. Okay, which one's the truth? When they witness a murder. Uh, I said, Dari, that you can say whatever the hell you want. Uh, just don't, yeah, don't be offensive. We're all trying to have fun here. That being said, I don't give a shit. Say whatever, say whatever you want. There was one earlier, like TMOS pointed out, that he wrote yeah, getting an erection, and one of my one of my lies on here is pretty bad too. Okay, let's take a look. When they see a puppy kicked. Oh, damn it. Good job, Kisty. Got you, Diamonds. And it was also. Wow. Wow. That was weird. No, not really. Great minds. Think alike. Wow. Minus a thousand. Ouch. Hmm. Interesting. Which means they just haven't listened to. I guess the other percentages are higher, huh? And that means. 
I figured that orgasm would have gotten a lot more. Oh well. Damn it, Christy! <clears throat> I'm not a fan of you right now. I'm just Time kidding. To pick a category. Pick us a good one. Pick us a good one. Okay, here's the question. Hmm. The New York Times was forced to issue a correction after they incorrectly identified the Nintendo characters Mario and Luigi as blank instead of plumbers. Enter your lies now. It's not going to get picked. I don't care. It's still funny. It's funny to me. No more. Who's gonna be the last one? There it is. All eyes right. entered. Okay, here are your choices. <laughs> plowers. <laughs> I like plowers. I think I may have picked the wrong one, but whatever, it's okay. Okay, what did everyone? As Spartans. Pick? No. Oh, wow! Six of us just landed on the same one. It. Nobody else's lives got picked. Hmm. Nobody let nobody thought they were gigolos? Really? Okay. Damn. Kisty just <coughs> smoking us all. Alright, pick a category. Little duck? Little duck. Pick yourself a category. Kicking, cowbell, lion. Okay, here's the nice. question. In 2013, a zoo in China attempted to pass off a blank as an African lion. Type in your lies now. I think about how to spell that for just a second. Uh-huh, Kisty, I'm sure it's never happened. Miss, I want to play Fibbish. I think it'll be fun. Yeah, it turns out you're a damn ringer. Coming in here all suave and Tom Cruise on us. Then you risky business the crap out of it. I'm on to you. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> a German immigrant. <laughs> Oh, German immigrants getting a like. Little person's getting a like. That was pretty good. All right, let's see what everybody picked. You know what? Show me cougar. <laughs> Show me house cat. Oh, give me your points. Please, please, please. Yes. Suck it, nerds. People became suspicious when it passed on a dead gazelle in favor of a bowl of sausages. <laughs> that would and probably give you away. Up there. Dude. Oh my word. That's, that's, that was really nice. Thank you. I needed that boost. Final fibbage. It's okay. Don't worry. It uh, it can absolutely just shift completely around here. It's anybody's game. Here's your final fibbage question. Name of the Rhode Island School of Design's penis-shaped hockey mascot. And to your eyes now. That's. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, man. I just thought of an even better one. I mean, it would never get picked, but, uh, I, like, now I've hyped it up way too much because it's not really that funny. Uh, Zamboner. Like, Zam or Zam Zamboner, rather. 
Zomboner. All right, where's the truth? <laughs> Gerald the Junk, Puckmeister General, Long Dong University. I'm gonna go with Scrody. I like Scrody. That deserves some points, regardless of what it's for. Uh, let's see. Gerald Junk and Long Dong University get some likes. Why not? The Puckmeister General. Pick something. Okay, let's take a look. Was it Peter? No. Sadly not Peter. Was it Puckmeister General? No. How about Floppy Joe? Damn. Good job, Timos. That was a great lie. Racking up those points here in the last round. Was it Scrody? Yeah. Give me that truth. Give me that truth. You can't handle this truth. Out on the ice. And we're done. <laughs> Let's see how we came out, ladies and gentlemen. Fred, then Random, then Mike, and me. All the way to the top. Yeah. Sup. Wow, good job, Azure. Getting the uh, Azure, getting the full 20 maximum likes. Good job. Uh, let's see. No, stop, 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 stop. What you're doing? Stop what you're doing. There we go. Okay. Uh, well, let's see. I promised that one game, and then we're going to take another short break here. When we come back, uh, we may play another game of Drawful. I may play a game of League of Legends and just kind of start to round out the night. I don't know. Um, no. You know what? I actually kind of have to get up early in the morning, so I'm going to go ahead and call it a night here. Uh, Fred, if you'd like to stick around, I'm just going to sign off here, and we're going to call it a night. Uh, because I've been going for five plus hours, and I'm rather tired. So thank you so much for coming out tonight, everyone. It means the world to me that actually let me turn this off before i say that Let's do my little speech here um thank you so much for coming out tonight everyone it really means the world to me that that you all support me the way that you do um i i i love making videos for you guys for the internet uh for myself really i i, I make the videos that i love and it means the world to me that you guys love them at least half as much as I do. Um, I hope to keep making videos for you guys as long as I'm able to. And uh, nothing could possibly make me happier. I think, I think that that's the best thing that I could possibly say. To, to put a nice little cap on the last two years, the, the work that I've been able to do, the response that I've gotten, the everything that I've... the Everything that I've been able to do because of the work, that, the hard work that I put into this channel, uh, it, it, I'm floored. I'm absolutely floored. And I can't wait to keep doing it. You know, this is just two years and I want 20 more years. I want 40, 50. I want all the years more to do everything that I want to do. And so I'm really glad that you guys are on that ride with me. Uh, You've been watching this on twitch.tv slash Tim Leftwich. You can subscribe to me at youtube.com slash Tim Leftwich. Links to that are down below. Um, thank you so much for watching, everyone. I love you all so much. And as always, we'll see you next time.